Hello, all you beautiful people. Um, this video is going to be the first of a sequence of videos that I'm going to um, use to try to help others. And what I mean by that is um, I am currently on medical leave uh, from my work. Uh, I've had some pending back issues that have uh, up until a certain point this year been manageable, but uh, after a certain point this year, it became unmanageable. And the pain does not stop. The pain has not gone away. So uh, with some appointments um, and talking to a neurologist, um, we're uh, now in the stages of trying to figure out exactly what's going on. Here's what we know so far. Uh, L5, the uh, disc at L5 has herniated and the disc at L4 is bulging. And we are, um, of course, very concerned about that because it is uh, compressing nerve roots down into my right leg, my right foot and my right, right uh, part of my leg seems to be going to sleep. Um, and like I said, the pain just never ends. It, I take pain medications, it helps me sleep, but as far as the pain goes, it does little to uh, offer me any comfort. So what we have so far is this Thursday, I'll be going in for yet another steroid shot. It's already been pre-authorized by the insurance company uh, to try to give me some kind of relief until uh, we decide what surgery I need for my low back. That has yet to be determined. Uh, the doctor, the neurologist, uh, has ordered a series of MRIs, uh, one for brain. I, I told him I, I know what the outcome of that one is already. Um, neck and thoracic or upper spine. Uh, since I've already had the lower lumbar MRI, which revealed the problem with the discs. The reason the doctor wanted to uh, do the other series is I've got, I've also got some severe weakness in my right leg and he just wants to make sure that there's nothing else going on um, with, with nerves in other places in my spine. So he's gonna, he went ahead and ordered or will be ordering a series of MRIs to cover those bases. Right now, we're waiting on a pre-authorization from my insurance company um, to uh, go ahead and schedule the MRIs. And after the doctor has all of the MRIs and he has the um, results of the nerve test that I'll be doing this coming, uh, well, actually on November the 2nd, I'll be having a nerve test and the MRIs. As soon as he's got all that information together, He's going to, I'm going to go in and see him at 1030 on November the 2nd. And we're going to try to come up with a game plan on what we're going to do with my back. Uh, I am on medical leave with my company for three months. Uh, after three months, I'll have to go on long-term disability if necessary. I hope it doesn't come to that. But right now, I just don't know. Right now, I have no idea what we're going to do about my low back. Um... Let it be God's will. Let it be his will, uh, what he wants to do and whatever his will is, then that's, that's how it is. Um, I trust him. I trust him implicitly. And I know that he's always working for my best interest, always. So um, uh, I'll continue to pray about it. I hope you'll pray for me too. Uh, this is a very nerve-wracking journey. We're very concerned. We're very worried. But we're also mindful that uh, ultimately God is in control. And we know that he will, uh, he will guide us whatever way we're supposed to go. Um, as far as videos goes, I have about five that are posted uh, to YouTube. Um, and they are scheduled for publishing. Um, I'm hoping somehow to get a couple more videos stocked up and stacked up uh, to cover me while I'm down. 
because my commitment, uh, I realize my health has to come first and I realize I've got to heal and all this stuff. And I'm not going to be a difficult patient like some people I know, you know who you are. Um, I'm, I'm going to do everything the doctor tells me to do. I'm going to do physical therapy. I'm going to do exercises he tells me to do because I want my back to heal. I want it to heal properly and I want to be able to continue doing the things that I like to do, doing the things that both Christine and I like to do. And uh, as you know, we love doing videos for you guys. We love going hiking. We like biking. We like going to the historical places, the old places. So um, I may be down for a little bit, but the videos will keep coming one way <laughs> One way or another, if I got to crawl out there on my walker, I will. Um, but nevertheless, uh, I just wanted to let you guys know what was going on. This is the first of probably a dozen or so videos that I'll be posting as to uh, pre-op uh, preparation for the uh, impending surgery and then the recovery and the recovery efforts and the things I have to do in order to recover. Uh, post-operatively in the hopes of helping someone else who might be looking at the same type of situation or scenario that I'm going through. Um, let God's will be done. Um, pray for me. Pray for my family. Um, if you uh, could possibly uh, subscribe to our channel, it would help us out a lot. We would appreciate it very much. Um, if you would please uh, give me a big thumbs up. On the video and uh, I will keep you posted. Um, this is the, like I said, the first of at least a dozen or more uh, videos to track this whole process and I'm going to track it for uh, pretty well too because I want folks to see what it's like to have to go through something like this, what to expect, uh, maybe give them some tips along the way that I've learned from others in, in my same uh, situation. So um, thanks for watching. Uh, stay post, stay tuned. Uh, keep an eye out for the next video. Uh, we appreciate you. We appreciate your support. Please pray for us. Thanks a lot. We'll see you on the next video.